Hi everybody, it's Crystal. So, well, I'm gonna go to, I'm just gonna go to Michael's today, but I didn't make it. So I decided to go to Goodwill and see if they got any yarn and see what else they got. And then I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree and see if my Dollar Tree has any yarn. Usually they never do, but I'm gonna check it out anyways. And then I'm going to go to Walmart again and see maybe, I don't know what kind of yarn they got going on there. Cause I heard they've been getting some new yarns to that new um, Red Art Huga yarn. I've never even seen it, but someone said they got it at their Walmart. So I'm gonna check my Walmart out. So if you guys wanna come along, you can. Remember, you never have to come along. But here, I'm gonna turn my camera around. I'm in Goodwill now. Okay, first thing I like to do is look at their bags here at the Goodwill to see if they have any handles that I can use. Oh my, those are pretty. Look at those handles on that bag. But I don't like to pay a lot. I looked and I seen it said blue tags are 50% off. So let's see how much this bag is. First, I gotta get this one off the handle. Oops. Those handles are really pretty, aren't they? Same on both sides. Let's see, it's a yellow. $3.99, so $4 for those handles. Those are in pretty good shape. Yeah, I think I'll buy those. It's nice, I found one right off that I liked. Okay, let's see what else we got. Um, those are some cute little brown ones, I guess. But I've had some like that at home, so I'm just gonna take a quick look here and see if I see any more handles. Um, these black ones are kind of neat right here. I have some similar to that at home also. I probably won't get it because it's not on sale. These handles are neat, but I do have some of those already. Um, let's see. Oh, that's cool. Look at this one with these big old rings. It's one handle. Let's look at it. Sorry about my camera skills. I'm not that... I don't do a lot of vlogs, so... It's got some rust on it. I think that could probably come off. Let's check the price of it. Let's see what we got. Not on clearance. $3.99. I'll probably pass on that one. Also. I usually don't get them unless they're half price. But these I happen to really, really like. So I'm going to pay full price for them. And still, $3.99 for a pair of handles is pretty good if you ask me. Hmm. Got a lot of bags here today. Sometimes they don't hardly have any. I wasn't eating a white pair, but those are kind of tore up, so I won't get those. Got some felting yarn at home I wanted to use, but I needed some white handles that aren't tore up. I want them. I like purse chains too. There's the purse chain if you see it. I have one kind of similar to that. It's not on cellular, so I'll probably pass on that. Okay, there's one more white handle. Let me check it out back here. That's no, too long. All right, let's go see if they got a yarn here. Usually they don't, and when they do, it's too much money, but. Thought maybe that was like a Chanel or something. Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Never know what you're really gonna find at the Goodwill store. Sometimes you find expensive stuff for really cheap. Name brands. Okay. I'm gonna walk on over to the um uh yarn section. I also like to check the belts out because sometimes they have good buckles on them that you can use for your bags. No, I'd pass on that too. Okay. Let's head on over here. Let's see what we got. I always got to step, stop and look at the old um, crochet stuff that people just kind of 
abandoned, you know. It's really, I said it before, it kind of saddens me, you know, someone spent so much time on that. Chevron Afghan, look at that. $3.99. Such, such a shame. Sometimes I rescue them. Sometimes I don't. Hmm. They're getting their Christmas stuff out already. Look at that. It's about that time of year, I guess. Seems earlier and earlier every year. Okay, let's go look. I see some bags of yarn over here, but they always want so much here at my Goodwill for yarn. Let's see what we got down here. Set my purse down. What's this? Yarn B. $2.99 for one. I'm going to pass on that. Yeah, it is originally $7.99, but it's still more than what I want to pay. For Nat, $6.99 at Hobby Lobby. $2.99 here. I'm going to pass on that. Here's a bag of yarn. Let's see how much this bag of yarn costs. Got some Vanna's Choice. $3.99. That's not bad. It's got one, two, three, four. Well, four brand new skeins in it. And then used ones. Three ninety nine. dollars so it'd be like a dollar for each one of these. I don't know about that. Here's another one. Let's see what this is. This is three ninety nine again. For four four skeins. Which, impeccable, it's impeccable, and banner. I think I'm going to pass on them. I mean, that's a pretty good deal, a dollar a skein, but it's not really skeins I'm probably going to use. So, let's see what else I got here. Maybe I'll get another one of them grab bags. I got a lot of single yarns here. Dollar ninety-nine. I don't like that red heart scent, but they yarn very well. Hard to work with. A lot of Christmas stuff here. Hmm. Oh, I love old vintage things. So much. Look at them old vintage wooden wheels. I like to decorate this with this kind of stuff too. JP Coats. Old Coats and Clarks box. That's super cool. Old Red Heart. That's coats. And, it was coats. Then it went to coats and Clarks. Now it's Red Hearts, coats and Clarks. Super cool. Super vintage. Still got the thread on some of them. Yeah, I might have to get that. Only because I got a obsession with old vintage things. Yeah, probably their yarn is just too much money for me here. Oh, he's cute. But I'm not decorating for Halloween right now. What's this bag of yarn in? Bag of yarn scraps? What is this? Oh, it's an old latch hook kit. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That I think I will pass on that too. I don't latch it. And if I did, that seems like it would be kind of a mess there. I don't see any bags of anything. It's all Christmas stuff. There's some ribbon. Well, they don't have no fun grab bags this time like last time they did. Um, okay, well, I'm gonna put these bags of yarn up. It's a good deal. I mean, don't get me wrong, a dollar skein there, because they're all new, but this is not what I'm gonna get, not for me. Oh, I'm gonna get this probably, this old. Okay, let's see what else we got. I'm going to shut the camera off for a minute real quick. Okay, we're done at the Dollar Tree. Just got... Goodwill. Or Goodwill. Goodwill. I got. I just got some t-shirts and stuff. Like, If you don't follow me all the time, you know I usually buy all my <laughs> clothing at the Goodwill store. Saves me money for uh, yarn. Plus, they got some cool clothes. Don't say babe. Yes, they do. We bought some cool shirts. I did find some cool shirts. We get all our stuff from the Goodwill store. We don't need to shop anywhere else usually. No. 
Okay. I get some stuff at Walmart once in a while. Sometimes, yeah. Okay, we're at the Dollar Tree. I'm going to see if they have any yarn. Something tells me that they're probably not going to. But it doesn't hurt to look. Because people say that they their Dollar Tree has it. I would imagine it'd be in the craft section over here. I need back in the floor here. Over here, I think. You looked over there. I'll look here. My Dollar Tree never has yarn. Every time I come here. And then I ask them and they act like I don't. Like, what? Yarn at the Dollar Tree? I don't think so. No. No, I'm not seeing any. I didn't see. No. I see pictures people post on Facebook of all this Dollar Tree yarn. And I'm like, man, my Dollar Tree just ain't got nothing, I guess. Alright, we're out of here then. I knew they wouldn't, but it doesn't hurt to check since it's right by Goodwill. I'm going to head over to Walmart. Never know, see if they got that. One day. Yeah, I might strike gold one day. That's why it never hurts to look, right? Yeah. All right. And it probably would be gold because it's that patents around usually at Dollar Tree, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I get from Dollar Tree Online is that patents metallic. I really like that. It could be gold for real. Patents metallic gold. You're correct. Okay, I'm going to head over to Walmart and see if they have that new Hugo yarn here. I'm going to shut it off till we get there. Okay, we're at Walmart. I'm coming to the yarn section. Let's see if they have that yarn I want. Let me turn the camera around. So you don't have to look at look at my mug the whole time. Just one second here. I'm not sure. I can't even remember how to spell that hoopla. Hoglawa. It's not pronounced how it's I came. It's Red Heart. Yeah, Red Heart. Yeah, it's fuzzy. I think it's a five weight. I'm not sure. I didn't know much about it, but I got all I got their white ones uh, already. I'm making something with those. Let's see. I never have nothing here. Nothing new for me. I don't know. Do they? It's kind of empty and bare. No, they don't have that hoogla yarn here. I knew they wouldn't. My Walmart never has nothing. My Walmart never has nothing. How do you, uh... How you spell that yarn? Yeah, H-O-O-G-A-L-A. -O -O that's how it's pronounced, but that's not how it's spelled. It has a Y in it. I know everybody watching this video is saying how it's spelled, but... <laughs> they don't have it. I don't see it. Hmm. Let me look at this, uh... Making it up. I'm not making it up. Google but doesn't even know what you're about. Google may not know what I'm talking about. They don't know everything. I know they think they do, but they don't. No. They know what we're talking about when we're not talking to Google. Yeah, I know. This is pretty. What's the color? I think it's jazzy. I've never had this color. Jazzy. I'm going to get one. Here. I'm going to make something beautiful out of that I don't know what yet let's see I've made some did they have the black one I really would like to get the black one right there this one right here yeah let's find a nice skein of that gray. yeah grayish black I guess so, anthracite I like one that has a mixture of all the colors in it that one's nice we doing throwing yarn around just put that in the cart my husband, I can't believe he's just doing that. Just set it up here. You're disrespecting yarn, Eric. Mr. Bod. Eric. How could you? It's weird to hear you call me. It is weird to hear me say Eric. I never call him Eric. I always call him babe. I always have, haven't I? And he calls me babe. And now Eli calls us babe too. <laughs> My five year old, he's like, babe. Or I'll be like, where's your daddy? Be like, babe's in the other room. <laughs> That's it's funny, ain't it's it? What? That's that. I haven't tried that yet, but Home decor. I don't Home know. Deck. It seems kind of expensive. I think I've seen it cheaper. I like this yellow one. Gold. Cotton nylon. Blade. Cotton nylon. Probably nice and stretchy, I guess. I'm gonna wait until I can find that cheaper. I think there's that's cheaper at Michaels and stuff. I, if I'm not, I could be mistaken, but 
I'm thinking that it is. Sometimes Walmart doesn't beat everybody's prices. Well, let's hit the clearance aisle see if there's any yarn in it. I'm sure there's not since... It, it can't beat nobody's prices now with all the tariffs. Yeah, I see that uh, my carry-on went up. I don't know if that's from the tariffs or not, but... It used to be... I thought carry-on used to be two ninety eight. Now it's three twenty seven. Ridiculous. I'm not happy about that. Red Heart, I thought, used to be two eighty eight. Now it's two ninety four. Is that correct? You guys tell me in the comments if I'm wrong. I thought it Red Heart was two eighty eight. Now it's two ninety four. And I thought for sure Karen was like two ninety eight and now it's three twenty seven. Let me know what it is at your Walmart. I could be wrong though on that, but but I do know that Karen went up. I'm not sure about the Red Heart, but I think it did too. It seems like it was too. Mainstay is the same price. Um, it's pretty hefty here on this Red Heart with Love rack. Oh, yeah. Okay, they don't have anything I can't live without, but I do need to go to the buttons and get some buttons for a special project that I'm in the works of making right now. Let's head over there. Plus, everybody knows if they watch my yarn shopping videos. I can't come to Walmart and look at yarn without turning the corner and looking at the buttons. Correct? It's I'm never, correct. It's never happened on any trip I've ever been I like to look at buttons. I need a, uh, a wooden button actually, just one. Um, uh, for that uh, thing I'm making right now. Um, a wooden button? One of these. One I don't know. One of these. That one would probably be pretty. Oh, I like that one. This yeah, that's three of, bucks. It's like a cork or something. Yeah. I guess get that it's one. Oh, it's coconut. Coconut. Is it a coconut shell? Is that what that is? I don't coconut. know. Hmm. Um, we'll actually use. I actually have something with that button on it. I have something. So you have one of these buttons at home? No, I don't have. No, I don't. It's on a project. It's someone on a project. Oh. Put away. I need some buttons for a sweater I'm making. Some brown wooden buttons. Oh, that won't match the yarn I'm using. I actually think I have some buttons at home that I'm going to use for the sweater, but I do need one wooden button for the thing I'm making right now. I'll go with, uh, you pick, babe. Either one of these two will work. You, su you surprise me. I like this one. Okay, let's do it then. Throw that Unless in you like the coconut. Thing. No, I like them both, so I'm good with either one of them. Because I'm using brown yarn, so either one would work. I still want this brush right here. Really bad. Yeah, this is cool. so, so expensive. I have that one, but man. I'll get it maybe next time I come. Okay, I'm going to shut this off. I'm going to head to the clearance aisle real quick. Okay, clearance aisle. I, I look for yarn every single time I come here. And they never had it. Never. Just that one time I came here, they did. Hmm. Not seeing anything. Well, it's kind of busy today. I don't like it when it's busy. Okay, let's see. These are clearance toys. Okay, they have nothing. I guess that ends my video then. Okay, I'm done at Walmart. Unfortunately, my Walmart trip and my Goodwill trip and my Dollar Tree trip all ended in despair of me not finding any yarn other than those two skeins of Red Heart Ombre that I got in the brown button, which I already have used for. So, it was a sad trip. Sorry you had to come along and, and see it. It wasn't really cool, was it? It's okay. If you guys notice, yes, some good shirts. I have a black eye. That is from... No, Not from me. <laughs> that is from um, Evelyn and Eli. They have one of them drawing pads, you know. Um, what are the things called? It's like a Draw magnet, doodle magnet, thing. Magnet, magnet, magnet drawer. And it has a pin attached to it on a string. Well, they were fighting over it, and Evelyn ripped it out of Eli's hand and swung it back and hit me right in the eye. It was like two days ago, but the bruise just now showed up. So are we done? I figured you guys would ask me that in the comments. So, yeah, we're done. Oh, and also, I do have a pattern for this hat, because usually everybody asks me that, too. Look on my YouTube channel. You'll find that there, too. So, 
like I said, I, this is just one of them not so cool yarn shopping trips. But next time I go to Michael's, I'll take you guys along. Thanks for coming, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye, guys.